I think a good discussion we should have is what is decentralized? Can you guys answer that? What is it? What is your definition? Decentralized means that the information is not stored in one location. Okay, so if that's true, BitConnect Bit would have been decentralized, right? If they had one server in one house and then they put another server in their friend's house next door neighbor. Two different internet connections, two different accounts, two different locations. Do you believe, oh, Crypto Lima, that that's decentralized? Is that the definition? Just more than one location? Is it? Let me know. Let me know right now. We are going to discuss right now, guys, what is the definition of decentralized to you? Somebody says yes. That's not how decentralized works. No, no, no. Prog coin. The only project that decentralized is Bitcoin. Oh, wow. Richie Rich has got some fighting words. Decentralized to me is no one person controls it because sure is regulated. Sup, baby, Richie Rich. <laughs> Yeah, Richie Rich. So Richie Rich, guys, if you didn't see it, people on Twitch, uh, Richie Rich said Bitcoin is the only decentralized currency. The only one. Okay, what do you guys have to say to that? Richie Rich, my argument to you is who controls the hash? And if that person controls the hash um, and they are one company, are is that still decentralized? Yes or no? Decentralized means that many parties completing against each other for one network consensus, says Samuel W. Almost all coins are decentralized. Oh, did you see that, Richie Rich? Did you see that? Yo, somebody claims that almost all of the coins are decentralized. Richie Rich says all the only coin is Bitcoin. Wonder why he says almost all the coins. The another guy says uh, anybody, any coin where not one person controls the le le lever. Now, when you mean one person, you actually mean one organization, right? Because you can have one, you can have five people needing to do a multi-signature on a wallet or on an uh, exchange or multi-signature on a uh, project, token project or multi-signature on uh, access to even algorithms or rigs. And now you're, now you're having that issue. So you tell me. Well, as long as you mine every block, it's not decentralized, but many different miners mine different blocks, Crypto Lima says. Okay, all right. How many different miners do you have to have mining to be decentralized? And guys, I think, you, I think somebody can pick up on what I'm, what I'm saying here. I think we're gonna have to get, change subjects, but do you guys get what I'm saying here? Some people believe that only Bitcoin is decentralized. That's the only one. Some people believe that having two miners in two locations is decentralized. Some people believe that uh, um, you have to have lots of different people mining from all over the world and what that exact amount is and inside back to backhand deals of where these coins are actually going and whatnot. You know, you don't really know, but you think it's decentralized. So what I'm trying to say is, uh, in a way, the internet is, is almost more decentralized than cryptocurrency right because i mean you can post a uh, an article online from your home and add to this thing called the internet take a photo from your phone in public and add to this wealth of knowledge to the internet which should most likely be there forever you can't do that with bitcoin right not everybody really has the ability to have an asic or rig in their home to add not everybody can code to add, like, it's not really there. Smart contracts is maybe the closest thing, but they're not smart yet, and not the everyday can, person can use them. I couldn't program them. So like, it's not really decentralized, but the internet in a way kind of is in that sense. But then again, you're, if you're basing it off of the servers, well, where are the servers to run the data? You don't really know who controls the servers. If that photo went, does that photo go to Google or Facebook or Twitter? Who owns that? Like, what if you put them on all platforms? Then is that photo decentralized because it's on three different platforms? So, yeah. Somebody says, just because you don't believe, just because somebody believes it doesn't make it so. Uh, right, that's my point. That's my point. So, 
The reverse can be said for decentralization as well. Basically, at the end of the day, there's no such thing as decentralized. Oh, snap. There you go. There you go. AZ, Imuroza, I think we are 100% on the same page. He says, basically, there is no such thing as decentralized at the end of the day. And he says that because it is up for interpretation on what you believe and who you trust and the systems that are in place there. And I would have to say I completely 100% agree. And what my point is, is all of us have different definitions of what decentralized is. 